Chicago police hope new images will help them catch the two suspects responsible for a brutal robbery and attack on the CTA red line. We're about to see it. As WJN's Andrea Medina reports, the entire incident was captured on video, which now has gone viral. Chicago police report they had another busy weekend responding to several shootings. Police say more than 30 people were shot and at least seven people were killed. Our thoughts remain with those who've lost someone to violence. That's why the Chicago Police Department won't stop working to bring justice to victims and their families. But not all of the violence came from gunfire. Oh my gosh, Charmaine. Deshaun Terry is the one behind the camera recording an elderly man being confronted by two people on the 95th CTA Red Line train early Sunday morning. One woman tries to step in, but the two suspects then reach into the victim's pockets. One of the suspects pulls a wine bottle out of the victim's jacket and hits him over the head with it. Why you hear me saying, oh my God, so much? Because, like, is this really happening? Like, I've never seen no one ever in my life get hit in the face with a bottle. Terry asked not to be on camera, but she's sharing this video and what she encountered in hopes the suspects are found. And when I think the blood, I just immediately felt so bad. Like, I felt so terrible. Before Terry called 911, she says she tried to look for help, but no one was around. We went upstairs to look for the operator. It was no one, um, no CTA workers, no nothing, no police, no security, no, it was no one. We've been increased our uh, manpower with the CTA for the public transit details, so I think we're doing pretty good. Terry relies on the L train to get to and from work. She hasn't noticed any visible efforts to curb violence on the transit system and believes more can be done. You can't afford to have your passengers feel safe. CTA's response is that this kind of behavior is absolutely reprehensible and should not happen to any CTA customer. Terry says she's terrified to get on and urges people to not let their guard down if they have to ride the train. I wanted people to be aware of how dangerous it is riding the CTA at night. Like there's like no one to protect anyone. On the south side, Andrea Medina, WGN News.